Hey guys, this is your trusted weather forecast, and today we're going to be talking about Tropical Storm Ada that just made a significant landfall as a likely Category 5 hurricane in Central America and brought well over 24 feet of storm surge to some of the areas and lots of rain. It is expected to re-strengthen into a tropical storm back in the Caribbean as it impacts Cuba and Southern Florida. A hurricane cannot be ruled out. Before we get into this, I'd like to ask you to subscribe. About 75% of you who watch my videos are not subscribed, so please click the subscribe button if you like weather-related content and hit the notification bell if you do not want to miss a single upload. Also, share this with friends and family and like the video to get this out to as many people as possible. Let's get right into this. This is the National Hurricane Center's forecast for Ada. They have it as a 40 mile an hour, barely a tropical storm as it enters the Honduras. It goes post-tropical as it enters the Belize area in Guatemala, the main threat in all of Central America is heavy rain, with over a foot of rain possible in some areas. In the Caribbean, again, around 12 a.m. Saturday, it re-strengthens into a tropical storm, and it approaches Florida around 12 p.m. Sunday as it slows down substantially bringing heavy rains to Florida and damaging winds, with a hurricane not being ruled out at this time. The cone of uncertainty gets quite large around Florida and could range anywhere from a Bahama landfall, which is very, very unlikely to mention it. A southern Florida landfall appears most likely at this time around either in the Miami area or the Florida Keys. A general weakening trend is expected after it pushes into the Gulf of Mexico. These are tropical storm force wind speed probabilities, and you see the lightest screen there is 20 to 30% chance to see tropical storm force wind speeds. And you may be wondering why the chance is so low at this time. It is because there is considerable uncertainty. This is intensity guidance for Ada, and you can see all of them have it maintaining tropical storm status back in the Caribbean. And two of the models have it going into low end category one intensity, which is fully possible, though a high end tropical storm is more likely. These are some of the potential paths it could take, and you can see it's actually pretty narrowed down up until just before a Cuba landfall, and you can see each line is a different path it could take, and they all have it curving back into the Gulf of Mexico after a Florida landfall, most likely, and the general weakening trend is expected when it does get into the Gulf of Mexico. This is the ECMWF model run, the latest one. As you can see, the tropical system makes a landfall around the Florida Keys with a pressure of 989. The lower the number, the stronger the system. As it pushes into the Gulf of Mexico, getting stronger in this one scenario with a pressure of 985. And then it curves towards Louisiana, strengthening further with a pressure of 971 millibars. And it starts weakening as it approaches the Florida Panhandle. This scenario right here is possible, but is one of the more unlikely scenarios. When this system does enter the Gulf of Mexico, a weakening trend is expected, not a strengthening one. This is one model, one scenario. Do not take it 100% for granted. These are current sea surface temperatures in the Atlantic right now. You can see the Caribbean, where Ada will be entering again towards Cuba is pretty warm with 29 to 30 degrees Celsius waters. It's good enough for strengthening, but as you get towards Florida, those temperatures start dropping. It will not inhibit strengthening though, but they do start dropping. And along the immediate coast of the Gulf, going from Texas to Florida, it drops even further, 26, 25, and even 22 in some areas. So the system will likely weaken before any additional landfalls if it even survives the Gulf. Question of the day for this video is what is your favorite restaurant to go out and eat to? Comment below your answers at what your favorite restaurant is and I'll look them over. That's the trusted weather forecast for upcoming potential Hurricane Ada that could reform. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment if you want. Goodbye.